Salvation is for you, the music band. For you, might I feel there is grace today. Yeah, oh, 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 oh. There is healing, deliverance, freedom from hosts of Satan. Yes, you bring your case. Come on, everybody, take your place. Come and experience for me saving grace. No matter your color, no matter your race. Mama, papa, they come. Woke wine be ya. Mutu mata so o. Baba ya ewa. Salvation is free, you don't need to pay. All the shame is in the way. Oh, oh, oh. GCK Gospel to every creature It's that time of the month again It's GCK o'clock In Mark chapter 16 verse 16 Jesus said Go ye into all the world And preach gospel to every creature we're bringing the gospel to every creature. Mothers and fathers, sisters and brothers. Jesus the Savior, there is no another. Salvation from yonder, since chains break us under. Yeah. Salvation is free, you don't need to pay. All of your shame, you will roll away. Salvation is free, the need to pay. All of the shame is to go all away. Are you bothered and you don't know what to do? And you feel like everything is wrong with you. Don't you give up when you look up. There's an answer to all your questions. We bring you the gospel, it's for every nation. Oh, Jesus. Salvation comes in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord! After I had an accident some years back, I cannot stand for a long time. If I stand, so be as if my two legs were stiff. But this night, you know, our father was praying. He mentioned it, God. I checked myself. I'm free. I can stand for hours. Yes, Master Jesus. 2006, I developed epilepsy and convulsion. And that lasted over to this year, 2024. And so much medications have been made that I was up the, the doctor told me that I was going to live with drugs all the days of my life. That it doesn't have a cure. But due to the prayer of the man of God, uh, the Lord touched my life. And due to his prayers, I was healed and free. Jesus, the Savior, the Savior. Is still saving the worst, the vilest of sinners. Tonight, as we begin a glorious transformation GCK, whatever 
your sickness. I rejoice with you tonight and the night of your healing. He healed yesterday, he's healing today, and he will heal every day of this crusade this month in God's own state, in Abia and everywhere in Jesus' name. transformation for the whole man by the name of Jesus that's the name that name has not lost its power that name will take every pain in your body away there's a confirmation of miracle in your life right now in jesus name we pray we have redemption through his blood even the forgiveness of sins you feel the guilt you feel the condemnation and you need forgiveness the forgiveness is here tonight expectation will turn to realization miracle healing Deliverance, the Lord is going to give you right now. It is done in Jesus' name. Your salvation comes in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord! After I had an accident some years back, I cannot stand for a long time. If I stand, so be as if my two legs were still. But this night, you know, our father was praying. He mentioned it, God. I take myself. I'm free. I can stand for hours. Yes, Master Jesus. In 2006, I developed epilepsy and convulsion. And that lasted over to this year, 2024. And so much medications have been made that I was up. The, the doctor told me that I was going to live with drugs all the days of my life. That it doesn't have a cure. But due to the prayer of the man of God, uh, the Lord touched my life. And due to his prayers, I was healed and free. And every contrary spirit power will be made to be still. Every
every contrary storm will be made to be still. In Jesus' name we pray. Isaiah 14 verse 3. And it shall come to pass in the day that the Lord shall give thee rest from thy sorrows. Amen. That the Lord will give rest from every sorrow. And from thy fear. And from the hard bondage wherein thou was made to serve. That we will experience the fulfillment, confirmation of this word of God in every life here today. The Lord will give rest from sorrow and give deliverance from fear and give deliverance from hard bondage. Open your mouth and pray. Every stone will be rolled off the tomb. And the voice of resurrection will pierce through the veils unto the demanded, needed lives here today. In Jesus' name we pray. Let us pray that today there will be a greater manifestation of the grace of God, the glory of God, the greatness of God, and there will be an overflowing of the goodness of God upon every life here today at a greater measure, a greater level to the glory of God. Open your mouth and pray. Five is higher than four. Five is higher than three. 
Five is higher than two. That so also the great things God will do here today on day five will be greater, will be higher, will be mightier, will be more miraculous. Open your mouth and pray. More marvelous, more awesome. Open your mouth and call upon the Lord. And as we are praying, you have testimony to share. You go to the left side here for interview before you come to testify. Those who have testimonies, please come forth so that we can take those testimonies. Remember the promise of God. He says, seek and you shall find. Whosoever seeketh, find it. This is the time we are seeking. This is the time we are knocking. And this is the time we are asking from the throne of grace. In Jesus' name we pray. Let the praying people say amen. We are going to.
to pray for our Father in the Lord, the servant of the Lord, and lift him up before the Lord and ask the hands of the Lord upon him, the power of the Lord upon him, the fullness of the Spirit of God upon him, that God today will make him a threshing instrument, a sharp sickle in his hand, and that through him today, yokes shall be broken. That through him today, shackles will be riven. Through him today, the tomb shall be rolled, the stone over the tomb shall be rolled away. And our desired miracles will flow. Let's pray for God's hands upon him, for God's anointing upon him, for God's grace upon him, for God's power upon him, for God's strength upon him. Open your mouth and pray. That the Lord will establish the proclamation of his mouth, of the word of God from his mouth. There will be a confirmation, an affirmation. The Lord will make him the channel of blessing through which the blessings of God unending will flow into every life today. Here and beyond here and all over the globe. As he proclaims the name of Jesus, the Lord will confirm his word, the word of God, with signs following.
In Jesus' name we pray. You are going to call upon the Lord and say, Oh God, my eyes are on you. As the eyes of the servants look on the hands of their masters, and as the eyes of a maiden on the, on the hands of her mistress, so are our eyes waiting upon the Lord. So call upon the Lord now and say, Oh God, I will not live as I came. Open your mouth and pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Our Father, we thank you because you are a gracious God, a great God, none like unto you, whose word standeth sure. We exalt you for what you have done all the past days, and we thank you for the promise, assurance of what you will do today and the remaining days. And our eyes are on you. And we are praying, Lord, Lord, that today every shakeable will be shaken in Jesus' name. And every movable will be moved in Jesus' name. And you feel our cups to overflowing and your name will be glorified. Thank you, Father, because we believe you have answered our prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We bless the Lord for bringing us to the five of this great program, Glorious Transformation Through Christ. And if you are here tonight, you know that this night is your night. God is visiting you with his healing, with grace, with mercy, with divine touch and salvation. Can you give me your biggest hallelujah? Hallelujah. We want to honor the Lord with our worship. We please request that we be on our feet as we worship the Lord. Let's be on our feet as we honor the King of glory. Messiah is the Lord of Lords. Messiah is the King of Kings. Messiah is the Lord of Lords. Jesus is the Lord. Yes. Jesus is the 
together for Jesus. Can you jam those hands together for Jesus? Amen. Amen. Hosanna. Hosanna. Hosanna in the highest. Hosanna. Hosanna. Hosanna to the King of Kings. Lord, we lift up your name. Amen, amen, amen. Sing, amen. Oh, rejoice, amen. Glory be to the Lord. Amen. I say, sing, amen. Amen. Rejoice, amen. Jesus, hallelujah. He makes the blind to see. Hallelujah. What manner of man is Jesus? Hallelujah. He saved the sinful soul. Hallelujah. What manner of man is Jesus? Hallelujah. He makes the lame to walk. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He makes the deaf to hear. Hallelujah. What manner of man is Jesus? Hallelujah. Say hallelujah. 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 Say hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah for the Lord God, O oh, minipotent reigneth. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah for the Lord God, O oh, minipotent reigneth. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. The Lord God, O oh, minipotent reigneth. He's the King of kings. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah, for the Lord God, oh, in the boats and trainers. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, for the Lord God, oh, in the boats and trainers. Oh, yes, hallelujah. 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 Welcome, hands to the Lord. Sing hallelujah to the Lord of God. Hallelujah, for the Lord God, oh, in the boats and trainers. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. I love the 
man of Galilee For he has done so very much for me He has forgiven now my sins And sent the Holy Ghost to me I love that man of Galilee, of Galilee I love that man, I love that man. Of Galilee. That man is here tonight That man is Jesus Very much for me of the world and tonight on this ground he's here tonight to touch you to heal you to save you that man of Galilee is here what can wash away my sin nothing but the blood of Jesus I say what can make me whole again nothing but the blood Your power, your glory, your grace, salvation, all over this ground and beyond, online, offline, on this ground. Lord, send it forth. That is what we need this evening. Come believing, come believing. Come to Jesus, look and live. Come believing, come believing. Come to Jesus, do and live. Come to living. From the Savior you have had Will you heed the invitation When to turn and see the Lord Come to live I say come to live in Come to Jesus Look and live Come to live Tribe on shall 
shall rise tonight. Do you believe it? The bones shall rise tonight. The sinners will be saved tonight. The blind will see tonight. The deaf will hear tonight. The lame will walk tonight. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Oh, Jehovah, he is able to do all things. He is able, able. I say, Lord, Jehovah, he is able to do all things. He is able, able. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Dry bones will rise tonight. Because our God, our Jesus, is able, is able to do all things tonight. If you believe, it will be so for you. It's not by might. It's not by power. It's not by power. It's by my spirit, says the Lord. It's not by might. I say it's not by power. He has said, and if you can believe it tonight, it will be yours. Amen. As a pastor, we've been preaching. Believe. Oh, that day. I remember that day. I will never forget the day when Jesus washed my sins away. My feet away. Have any day. 
tossed me And oh, what joy that fills my soul Some things happened And now I know He touched me and made me good Oh, he touched me He touched me Are you oh, sure tonight? He touched me Oh, he touched me And oh, Somebody today in Jesus' name. You are all welcome to the fifth day of this glorious freedom in Christ. This day is unique, being the fifth day, a day of grace. Amen. A day of power. A day for Jesus' manifestation. I want to welcome you and urge you to be in great expectation. And grace will do it all for you. Grace will lift you today. In Jesus' name. Let us pray. Almighty God, we thank you very much for this great time of divine visitation. This time of divine freedom, transformation, translation, intervention in our lives. Thank you for what you have done already. And thank you for what you will still do today. The day before the ending of the program, we are praying that, oh God, this glorious fifth day, grace will open doors for us. And grace will bring total, all-round freedom in Jesus' name. Lord, today we pray, your glory will come down. Your power will manifest. Your presence will be visible, and every one of us will rejoice in your presence in Jesus' name. You will use your servant more than ever before in Jesus' name. Thank you for answering our prayer. Thank you because we know it is done. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. A global amen. amen. God bless you. We're singing the song on page three at Calvary. Years are spent in vanity and pride, caring not my Lord was crucified, knowing not it was for me he died on Calvary. By God's word, at last my sin I learned. Then I trembled at the law I spawned, till my guilty soul imploring turned to Calvary. Now I've given to Jesus everything. Now I gladly own him as my Lord, my King. Now my rapture soul can only sing of Calvary. Oh, the love that drew salvation's plan. Oh, the grace that brought him down to man. Oh, the mighty God that God did span at Calvary. Mercy there 
was great and grace was free. Pardon there was multiplied to me. There my burdened soul found liberty at Calvary. <laughs> Lord, what a great joy to be in the presence of the Lord. Please keep standing when the session of the congregational prayer. We want to appreciate God. We want to worship Him. Look at what the Bible tells us in Psalm 103 verse 2. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. We want to thank God for the benefit of salvation. God has saved sinners since we started. He restored backslider. He healed the sick. He delivered the oppressed. 
We want to go before the Lord now and say, God, we are grateful. Close your eyes and let's thank God for the blessing we have been receiving since we started on Thursday last week. Our Father, we want to thank you for day one of this GCK. We thank you for day two. We thank you for day three. We thank you for day four. We bless you for the souls you save. May your name be glorified. In Jesus' name we pray. In this prayer session, we are praying for the globalization of the gospel. Look at what the Bible tells us. In Matthew chapter 24, verse 14. I'm going to read for you from here. Matthew chapter 24, verse 14. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a weakness unto all nations. And then shall the end come. You will agree with me that not many nations of the world have heard the gospel preached to them yet. And that is why we want to pray that the gospel of Christ will reach every nation of the world. Lift up your voice and pray. Heavenly Father, we bring the nations of the world before you. We are asking and praying that the gospel of Christ, the gospel of salvation, will reach every nation of the world. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name we pray. Give me an alpha location. Amen. We want to pray because it is the will of God that all men, all nations turn unto the Lord. Look at what our Lord Jesus Christ tells us in John chapter 12, verse 32. And I, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. We want to pray that Christ will be lifted up in every nation of the world, that in every nation, in every country, in every family, in every community, in every home, in every heart, that Christ will be lifted up. And as Christ is lifted up, men will be drawn unto the Lord. Let's pray. Let's pray. My sister, are you praying? My brother, are you praying? Pray that God will draw men to himself. Nations will be drawn unto the Lord. They will turn from sin unto righteousness. They will turn from ungodliness to godliness. Let's pray that God save the nations of the world. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh, I like the way you are praying. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, my brother over there. Thank even the little children. Thank you. The way you are praying, God bless you. We want to pray now. Remember, the children of Israel, they wanted to enter to possess Jericho. But the Bible says in Joshua chapter, one, chapter 6 that Jericho was strictly shut up so that the children of Israel will not possess it. But God gave Jericho to the Israelites. So many nations of the world today are strictly shut up to the gospel. And we want to pray according to Psalm 24, verse 7. He said, lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be lifted up, ye everlasting doors, and the king of glory shall come in. We want to pray that every nation of the world, the gates of those nations will be lifted up, will be open, and Christ shall come in. Christ shall reign. In Africa, Christ shall reign. In Asia, Christ shall reign. In America, Christ shall reign. In Europe, Christ shall reign. That is our heart cry this evening. Pray that Christ reign. Reign in Africa, reign in Asia, reign in Europe, reign in America, and let the gate 
of those nations, every nation be open up to the gospel, and it will be so. Let's dismount all the barrier to the preaching of the gospel, to the salvation of sinners in nation. Let's pull them down. Let's dismount them. You have authority. My sister over there, you have authority in your mouth. My brother over there, you have authority in your mouth. My beloved youth, you have authority in your mouth. Let's pull down all the barrier that are limiting the preaching of the gospel, the salvation of sinners in nation. And sinners will be turned unto the Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, we want to pray for our Father in the Lord. Look at what the Bible tells us in Acts of Apostles, chapter 19, verse 11. We want to use this verse to pray for our Father in the Lord and all other ministers. And God wrote special miracle by the hands of Paul. We want to pray that as our Father in the Lord go from state to state, from nation to nation, that God will wrote special miracle through his ministration in Jesus' name. Let's lift up our Father in the Lord that God will use him tonight as he comes up to pray. Miracle of salvation, miracle of restoration, miracle of deliverance will be wrought in our midst today. Sinner will be turned to the Lord. Let's pray. Special anointing, O God, upon your servant. Father, we lift off your servant before you tonight that you will anoint him specially and use him mightily to the glory of your name. That sinners will be saved tonight. That Baslada will be, will be restored tonight. Do it in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now we want to pray for all the participants of this crusade, including yourself, that God will touch you tonight. What do you want the Lord to do for you tonight? You are here with a particular need in your life. Tell the Lord, bless me tonight. I have come to your presence. I don't want to go empty-handed. Let's pray. All the participants here at this Alpha location and those online, and order in order or other participants in other location that the Lord will bless them, that the Lord will visit them. In Jesus' name we pray. Let's begin to worship the Lord because He has heard and answered our prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. A global amen. Almighty Father, we want to thank you because you are a great God who have seen your hands since we started on Thursday. And we want to pray that you will move mightily in our midst tonight. We want to especially pray for the nations of the world that have not received the gospel. We are asking and praying that this gospel of the kingdom will reach every nation of the world and they will turn unto you in Jesus' name. We present and lift up our Father and the Lord before you tonight that as he comes up to minister your word, special anointing upon him, you will use him mightily to the glory of your name. I pray for every one of us, the children, the youth, the adult here at the Alpha location and online every other location, you will bless us mightily tonight in Jesus' name. Thank you because you have heard and answered us. For in Jesus' victorious name we pray. Amen. Amen. If you are marked, for miracle tonight, shout a louder, amen. amen. If you are very sure that you are going to get double portion of miracles tonight, let me hear the loudest, amen. amen.
tonight is going to be great. For you. We are now on announcement. And the first announcement I want to give you, good news from afar. Our Father in the Lord is seated here already. He's here. Is that the way you are welcoming him? Jam your hand. Jam your hand. Amen. Amen. Say, Daddy, you are welcome, sir. Amen. 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 Have your seat. I want to tell you that our mother in the Lord, too, is here seated. The mother is in the house. Jam your hand. I can Amen. Amen. God bless you. Always note, there is a difference between clap your hand and jam your hand. When you clap your hand, it's just clap. But jam, you have to jam it very well. Amen. Amen. We have a lot of other dignities that are in our midst. But for the want of time, we'll not be able to recognize them one by one. I want to say to every one of them, you're all welcome. Tonight, the Lord will remember you for good. Amen. Let's remember, today is day number five. And I want to tell you today, the miracle that you will get, eyes have not seen. Ear has not heard. Neither has he entered into the heart of man. The great things the Lord will do for you. Remember tomorrow, we're going to have the minister's conference in the morning. I want you to come prepared. Isaiah said in Isaiah, um, Joshua Solid said in Joshua 3, 5, sanctify yourself. Get fully prepared. For tomorrow, the Lord will do wonders in our midst. Tomorrow, there is going to be great wonders. So tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., we'll all be all workers, all professionals, and all the ministers of the gospel were to be here for the minister's conference. Please invite other workers and pastors from other churches who have not been attending. On Friday, it was indescribable. Then today, it was marvelous. So I want to plead with you, every Christian worker you know, here and in all other places and all over the world, please invite them. Come along with them. And I'm telling you, tomorrow is going to be climax for the ministers. And then in the evening, by 5 p.m., before 5, let all the seats be filled up. All the people who have not come since Thursday till this day, make sure they are here the last night. And I'm telling you, tomorrow night, great things the Lord will do for us. Those who gave their life to Christ, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, yesterday, please remember the lunch hour with Jesus holding at the tent over there. Please be there 3 p.m. tomorrow to continue. And those who will give their life to the Lord today, let's all be there for lunch hour with Jesus. Tonight, something great is coming your way. If you believe it, your amen will be louder than this. The louder the amen, the greater the miracle. We listen to choir from the nation before we continue. We now bring you choir ministrations from regions, states, and nations across the world. Oh, sing. 
Praise the Lord. Have we gone home? Praise the Lord. In Psalm 35, verse 18, it says, I will give you thanks in the great congregation. I will praise thee among much people. The time it's for testimony. And I want to say, as you are listening to other people's testimony, get ready, because today you will be a testifier. Is that your amen? amen. Let the global community hear your amen, the global community. Shout a louder alpha location, amen. So as you listen to their testimony, be prepared because God will visit you tonight. Here and all over the world. Let's have the first testifier, please. I am Onikwede Peace, a medical personnel. And here beside me is Obioma Ukaku. She's here to testify to what God has done for her. Let's listen to her testimony. Praise the Lord. My name is Sister Obioma Okako from Aba region, Abia 2, Nigeria. I'm here to testify what the Lord has done for me. This started 16 years ago. I, was, I am having swelling stomach, but God touched me. During that time, I cannot lie with my stomach. Last year, GCK, October, lose him and let him go. In fact, God lose me through the man of God. God touched me. The swelling stomach, before that time, people are calling me pregnant woman. When are you going to deliver? I told them, leave it. It's a stranger that one day, the stranger must surely go. That October, God said that this stranger should go, and the stranger has gone. I'm free now, you can see. I don't have any other stomach swelling. God has touched me. I say, God, who did this? May your name alone be highly lifted up in Jesus' name. From our sister's testimony, we can see that she had what we call huge symptomatic uterine fibroid, and for, for 16 years, and after the prayer of the man of God, it is vanished. Jam your hand together for Jesus. 16 years problem, vanished. Last year, since that time till now, permanent. Your miracle today shall be permanent. Here beside me is Lillian Ioma. Let's listen to our testimony. Brethren, praise the Lord. Praise the living God. Hallelujah. Sister Amanachineke, Ahambo, Sister Lilian, Ihoma, Abumoyen Bise. Somewhere at this GCK Global Crusade, praise the Lord. Somewhere a couple of times in Homa, China came here. Now this GCK Global Crusade. Somewhere a challenge in where 
Kembe, 2008. So somebody in Granolia, I'm only an on an argument something. So I'm turning as you can for you. I'll call me here as soon. So me lara and lay a girl. So be rogue. My baby don't wear problem as so I be an are marim. Yeah, you know, I'm like this. My name is Shake here. I'm not sure. But yeah, when somebody was at one certain time, I sing a jam test. Nanga jam estre. Massy, I did test in the Madrid Strange Jimmy. So one dog off. I lay hurry on us, one dog off. So managa. A killer and shinneke came with that two thousand and eight. One day, there is zero paracetamol in Makaya. Moga hospital, more test, Makaya. So I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to Praise the Lord. So I'm going to go to this GCK Global Crusade. I'm going to go. Come receive from my healing. So praise the Lord. So I'm going to go to the hospital. Our general superintendent, no need be brave. He has a problem with a challenge. Give you what I say, Aka. So I'm not shaking around. Now what she need to do? See, I'm not arranging in 2008. Anything no blow. Now Balia. See, Tau, Abalise, now Cruzeria. So I'm going to be safe. Since our 2050, we have been this crusade. Praise the Lord. Since you know, I can be receive really my healing today. Only one way I may do it is praise the Lord. Since then, I can only say I bo na yuku bo WF kumuyi. Only you know, I can just run your zi. Now, Zuko di palai Bible Church. Ana ma si chineke. Only me ne miha. Ogo jine pe premne ton maru mna.